securing a mortgage is, is one of the most important things that you can do uh, when purchasing a home. And I always advise my clients uh, when we're just beginning the search and talking about what they're looking for in a house to figure out the financial picture. Um, this is one of the very first steps that we take. Um, and I always ask them, you know, is there a particular bank that they want to work with? Um, whenever I hear people tell me they're working with Chase or uh, Citibank or one of the big international, Wells Fargo, um, oftentimes, to be honest with you, I cringe. Uh, and the reason being is that all, when you're working, when you're getting a mortgage here in Albany or the Capital District, um, it's incredibly important to work with a local lending institution, one that relies on their local reputation and local referrals. Um, what I tell people is when you're uh, applying for with a mortgage for Citibank or Chase or Bank of America, oftentimes you know they have an origination department in Florida, an underwriting department in Texas, um, you know, a processing department maybe in California. And if something goes wrong in that process and we have to pick up the phone and call somebody, it can be really difficult. Um, more importantly, it's a big international bank. Uh, they're not so concerned about their reputation in here in the local market. Um, in contrast, if you're working with a local lending institution or credit union or mortgage broker, um, these people live and die by their reputation here in the Capital District. Uh, so they want to make sure the client is happy, the realtor is happy, that the transaction goes as smoothly as possible. And if there's a problem, we can pick up the phone and have somebody to call. Um, Secondly, it's also really important, uh, I try to get as much information from the client early on to figure out what is their situation. In this case, this year, this, this week, I had a client call me, um, he's a resident at Albany Met. Um, there's a particular bank here in the area that, that has loans specifically designed for residents, not doctors, but residents and interns who might have a lot of student debt, might not be making a lot of money right now, but have future earning potential. Um, if there's a home buyer who has really good credit, maybe they've got 10% down or more uh, that they have, uh, there's some very good local banks that have special products designed for people that have 10% or more down for down payment. Um, if you're like most buyers and maybe putting down less than 10%, um, you know, there's a lot of good conventional banks here, credit unions as well as, you know, mortgage-specific banks. Um, if you don't have the best credit, uh, or maybe have some credit challenges. Um, you know, there's a mortgage bro broker that I use who's spectacular and really has a, a large menu of options. So um, mortgages are important. I like to really figure that out up front. Um, and, uh, you know, that's all I have to report. Um, I'll promise I'll be back next week with, with, with trying to share some helpful insight and advice. Um, my name, Alex Monticello, and uh, you can check out our company anytime at MonticelloNYS.com. Talk to you next week.